Happy birthday, Yoga Life Institute. I'm Bob Butera. Yoga Life is 26 years old. Somebody the other day told me, do you know that 80% of all businesses fail in the first two years and your business is 26 years old? And I said, well, yes and no. Uh, yes, it is 26 years old. And we're very happy for all the people that have studied with us, who teach with us, who carry out the mission of educating people to, and helping them live healthier lives. But we're not a business. You see, when it first started, I was working at the West Town Friends School as a yoga teacher for phys ed and as a dorm parent, amongst other responsibilities. In that time, I taught yoga on the side just to offer a class here and there, and the classes were always rather large for the time. There were very few yoga teachers in the 1990s, and it was very much in demand, and people really wanted to learn how to cope with their stress. They wanted to learn some healthy practices. They wanted to learn how to meditate. So started teaching them. By the end of that year, I had four different groups, and it was almost too much because people kept adding on. I would have the classes fill, so I would say, well, I guess I'll teach Tuesday nights. And then Tuesday nights went to Wednesday nights. And then pretty soon I was at a church, um, a health food store, a business comp corporation. It was all over the place. And it came to the point where um, a chiropractor, when I, when I got kicked out of the health food store for having too many people, he then said, look, Bob, you have too many people for our chiropractic place. Even though we have a nice room for you, it's not worth our time to rearrange furniture. And he sat me down and said, go rent your own place so that you stop bothering everybody. And he loved our yoga classes and he wanted to keep coming with his wife. So I was like, okay, but that sounds kind of risky because see, that sounds like a business, but it wasn't a business. We opened up and 125 people showed up for classes that first series of eight weeks. So again, I wasn't making a business plan and then trying to bring people into a location. The people demanded the location for us to continue serving. So I feel like I'm in the service industry uh, for people who want to learn yoga. And that's how it kept going. So then we had a newsletter. I found a bunch of holistic doctors for my own health and for my friends, and I shared it with our yoga people, and they had tons of new patients. So they said, look, you should put advertisements in your newsletter. I said, it's a newsletter. I'm not a businessman. And they said, well, let's start a magazine. And somebody put that into my head, and I remembered some other holistic magazines when I was in California. And now I'm in Pennsylvania. They didn't have many. So we started a magazine and then it went to 65,000 copies. It was in every county surrounding the city of Philadelphia. And, and then the internet came along 19 years later and everybody said, well, I can find all my holistic stuff on the internet. So the, the magazine wasn't requested by people. So we stopped. The magazine didn't fail. It just wasn't needed. So then we put our time into training uh, yoga teachers. Well, that was very early on, actually, because people said, I'd like to teach. I want to learn how to teach. Could you show us how to teach? And I had already shown many individuals in a private program. So then we started teacher's training. Now there's a thousand graduates or more if you count some of our satellite um, centers. So those people are all teaching people. So we feel like we're teaching 25,000 people a week or more based on these thousand and some graduates. And kudos to you because we are helping people with their stress. We are part of a larger yoga movement. And if you add up what we all do together, we are helping literally millions of people, all of us together. So then um, one of our people said, I want to be a yoga therapist like you. And I was like, okay. They said, you got to train us. So it took me five years. And one of our teachers, Aaron Byron, threatening me that she's just going to do it if I don't do it. And, and we wrote a manual together then. I asked her for a year of planning. And the two of us wrote a manual together. And we started the yoga therapy training because people wanted to learn how to work with health conditions and work with people one-on-one. -on -one. 26 years, all we're doing is listening and trying to help. Now we do things online. Everybody tried it. They really liked it. So we keep doing trainings online. And we're going to continue to find out what everybody needs 
and do our best to play our role to continue serving. It's been a complete honor to continue doing this. And it's an honor to do it with so many other people. So to Yoga Life community, uh, happy 26th birthday. <laughs>